Hey everyone, Matt here. I just want to show you how easy it is to implement the new in-app guide table. So the first thing I need to do is add a new table, and I have already added the G sheet to my my Google Drive. So I'll select that, and from here, simply select the guide that you want to see, and add it to your table. And that's it. All you got to do now is wait for this to come back and make a view. That's a form so that you can see what it all looks like and your guide's ready to go. So I'll come over here to view. I'll make a new view on my table I just selected. That's a form with tabs for a better experience. And there you go. As you can see, it's all configured for you. Your guide's ready to go. You can start using it now. And that's all it takes to implement the new in-app guide system. Enjoy. So what are they? In essence, an in-app guide is a tutorial or a guide, a resource that you can use inside the app sheet editor here that will guide you through a process for doing something inside of your app. For instance, this one is how to implement an avatar builder. This one shows you how you can trigger a workflow manually using an action. This one shows you how you can use actions and workflows to delete all the child records when a parent is deleted. And so it's got everything that you need to know what to do. There's pictures, there's videos, there's helpful little bits, everything that you need in order to implement whatever the guide is showing you how to do. That's, that's what it's about. And it's as easy as just adding the table to your app. That's all it takes. 